A Bridgewater couple is in the hospital and a Florida man is under arrest, accused of attacking the two in their home. Police say that man was staying in the home with the couple. Good afternoon. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kate Merrill. And I'm Brianna Pitts in for Chris McKinnon. The violent attack began as the woman was getting ready for work this morning. WBZ's Bill Shields is live in Bridgewater for us with some more details. Bill. Brianna, this is very odd, very strange case because the victims, the couple in the house, they actually picked up the guy from Florida at the airport last night, brought him to their house. So it's apparent they all know each other. But something went terribly wrong right about 5.30 this morning. As officers arrived, they found two stabbing victims, a male and a female. At 5.30 this morning, it was mayhem at this well-kept home in Bridgewater. 27-year-old Andrew Soto of Florida flew into Boston last night and was staying at the home of the couple he allegedly attacked. The female victim woke up from work around 5.30 a.m., at which time she was called into the hallway by the suspect in which he assaulted her with a knife several times. The male victim attempted to stop the assault at the time. When doing so, he also received several stab stabbing wounds. Police were at the home within minutes and arrested Soto without further violence. The couple he allegedly attacked were hospitalized. The injuries to both victims, well, to the female victim, appears to be more in the head, face, and neck region. Um, male victim, I believe he has injuries also to the lower, lower torso, maybe chest area. Soto will be arraigned likely this afternoon, later this afternoon, because he is hospitalized too. He didn't have any wounds, but just for evaluation. Reporting live from Bridgewater, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News.